Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup, your go-to channel for the latest in music industry news and drama. Today, we're diving into a major headline that's shaking up the dance hall world, Vibes Cartel, one of Jamaica's most influential artists, has been freed from prison after judges decided he shouldn't face a retrial for murder. Stay tuned as we break down the key points of this groundbreaking story. First, let's recap how we got here. Vibes Cartel, real name Edija Palmer, was convicted in 2014 for the murder of Clive Lizard Williams. Despite always maintaining his innocence, Cartel was sentenced to life in prison with a minimum of 35 years before eligibility for parole. However, in March 2024, the UK Privy Council overturned his conviction, citing issues with juror misconduct that made the trial unfair. After his conviction was overturned, Jamaican authorities had to decide whether to retry Cartel. On Wednesday, Jamaican appeal judges concluded that a retrial was unnecessary. They considered factors like the serious nature of the original offense, the passage of time, the difficulty in accessing witnesses and evidence, and the huge expense of a retrial. They also noted Cartel's declining health. Vibes Cartel's release is a monumental moment for dance hall music and the Jamaican judicial system. Known for hits like Clark's, Ramping Shop, and Summertime, Cartel's influence on the genre is undeniable. His release was met with jubilation from fans and industry insiders alike. Shawnee B from BBC One Extra described it as a mammoth day for Jamaica and dance hall music. However, it's important to remember the family of Clive Williams, who still grieve his loss. Vibes Cartel's story is a powerful reminder of the complexities within the legal system and the impact of one man's music on an entire culture. As he returns to the music scene, the world will be watching to see what he does next. Thanks for tuning in to the Red Carpet Reup. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content. See you next time.